Hello welcome to the Clippers news channel, if you do not want to miss any news turn on notifications and leave your like. Straight to the center of the court, to find out what's happening behind the scenes with the Clippers. Now, NBA insider Shams Kyrania reports on the athletic discontent. The atmosphere within the Clippers is tense, with veteran forward PJ Tucker expressing dissatisfaction with his current role in Los Angeles. Both Tucker and the team are actively seeking a resolution to redefine his position within the Clippers or explore alternatives elsewhere. Tucker joined the Clippers through the monumental trade involving James Harden from the Philadelphia 76ers. However, his on-court contributions have been limited, averaging just 1.2 points, 2.4 rebounds, and a field goal percentage of 28.6%, along with a 27.3% clip from beyond the three-point line, all in an average of 14.4 minutes per game. With Tucker catching the attention of several contenders, his earnings for this season amount to $1 million, with a player option of $1.5 million for the 2024-25 season, further increasing interest in his future. Despite his extensive NBA experience, having been part of various teams including the Raptors, Suns, Rockets, Bucks, Sixers, and now the Clippers, Tucker continues to seek a more fitting role that aligns with his expertise. Currently, the Clippers have a record of 11 wins and 10 losses this season, with a 4-8 record when Tucker is in the lineup. The debut in the Harden era started with a stumble at 0-5, but there was a recovery to an 8-8 position, currently placing them ninth in the competitive Western Conference. As Tucker's situation unfolds, the impending trade deadline in February heightens speculation about potential outcomes. The possibilities of a trade or even his release loom on the horizon, sparking intrigue about the team's next moves and potential adjustments. What is your opinion on this possible departure? More updates will be brought to you here, so like and activate notifications to be the first to receive them.